Extraordinary Dogs is brought to you by Yukonuba, where we believe all dogs are extraordinary. As pack-orientated animals, wolf family units are extremely nuclear. Wolf packs consist of a loyal mated pair who take the role of leaders and protectors to both their biological offspring as well as any adopted subordinates. Domestic dogs will also feel an intrinsic bond towards their owners and adopted family and will protect them instinctively. This loyalty sometimes presents itself in surprising ways. Meet Buddy and his owner, Ben Heinrich. They live in the remote region of Caswell Lakes in Alaska. Last year, their peaceful life was shattered by a horrifying event, which proved to be a huge test of the bond between man and dog. As he often did in the early evening, Ben was fixing his truck when a spark ignited some gasoline. When the fire started, I had closed the door so the fire wouldn't expand outside. I got the fire off me, then I realized my dog was still inside. And I went back and so I could get my dog out. And that's when I said, we need to find help. And then he took off. The neighbors called the fire brigade and state troopers. Trooper Shanigan was the first person to respond. I was about five miles north of here on the highway. I received a telephone call that was the first I had heard of uh, the, the fire. They sounded frantic, said that there were injuries and that I needed to get, um, get there. They wanted help from a trooper or the fire department. Shanigan headed towards the Heinrichs residence through the back roads of Caswell Lakes when the one piece of equipment he needed most, the car's GPS, stopped working. With approximately 150 kilometers of back roads in the region, one wrong turn could mean getting lost for hours. Driving slowly while waiting for directions to come through from head office, Trooper Shanigan noticed something out of the corner of his eye. I saw just a shadow of something move, and to me that was, it seemed a little bit odd. So initially I pulled forward to kind of uh, investigate to see what, what that movement was. And as I came around the corner on that road, I saw that there was a German Shepherd. And from that point on, I never really thought twice about what it was that uh, we were both experiencing at the same time. I just began following him. I just went with a gut feeling. I think for just that minute and a half, Buddy let me in to something that he and Ben probably experience a lot more often. 